the courage of ship's cook, first class Frank Hill, to enter into the cloud of pressure, steam emanating from below deck after having been on the sick list for several days. After venturing into the scalding steam to bring injured sailors to safety, he fainted. Upon being revived, he returned into the cloud of steam twice more to bring additional shipmates to safety. Machinist mate first class Oscar Nelson's knowledge of the engineering spaces enabled him to make several rescue trips into the lower decks and save at least six of his shipmates. He was able to survive the superheated steam by breathing through a piece of waste he had jammed into his mouth. When he left the engineering spaces for the last time, all of the men, dead or alive, had been brought out. Chief Gunner's mate, John Clousey, averted an even larger disaster by going below decks to flood the magazine that contained the gunboat's six-inch shells. He had the fire and steam reach the magazine. The entire ship might have exploded, resulting in much lo larger loss of life. The wording of Hospital Stewart William Shacklett's Medal of Honor citation speaks not only of his actions, but speaks of all 11 of these heroic sailors. The citation reads, for conspicuous gallantry and intrepidity at the risk of his life above and beyond the call of duty while serving on the USS Bennington at the time of the explosion of a boiler. His exceptional fortitude, inspiring initiative, and unrelating devotion to duty reflected great credit upon himself and were in keeping with the highest traditions of the United States Naval Service. Unfortunately, history has not recorded the specific actions of the other five Medal of Honor recipients aboard the USS Bennington, but I think we may safely assume their actions were equally valiant. It is our great privilege to honor and remember these brave survivors of the USS Bennington as well as those that have perished. Their actions saved the lives of many of their shipmates. God bless them and all of the Blue Jackets that served aboard the USS Bennington. Reef Lane, your lay in the reef will be Philip Pinchuk, compatriots Philip Pinchuk, compatriots James Matter, both retired Navy. Flankers, unit flags present arms. Order arms. Ready to take our national flag. Flankers, turning four steps forward. Gather around the grave of Medal of Honor Cyprian, shipmate Cronin. Rock Partridge! Hi, Pat!
Welcome to the ready. Half cock hammer. Set. Fire. Prime pan. <clears throat> Charge fire lock. Order arms. 